Previously. Oh, almost. Not quite. <clears throat> Ow. Oh, what the? Oh, I didn't know there was a mine here. Well, F9. Soon. Yeah, I'll talk to you later, Nasty. I don't freaking... I'll trust you. You're like, hey, I have a job for you. And that's like, you have to kill these monsters. I'm like, wait, what? What? what, what, what why? Why? Why now? I'm a wuss. Right, Duras. You ready? We have one more component to find. Is this? No, it's not selected right now. So it is here. This one. Up here. Proprietary Edwards Condenser. Whatever the crap that means. Uh, okay. Yes. Right here. Oh, is this what's left over of a greenhouse? Interesting. I wonder if this is something the outlaws had made that fell apart, fell into ruin and stuff. Okay. Couple of... Um, what are they called? So there were Plague of Insects on the one quest, but I think the other one was called a Ripper. So, okay. Let's go over here, Duras. You stay here. Um, yep. Stay here. Sure. Okay. Now let me see if I can figure out where this is and how to get to it. And there's a... Who knows? A jackal maybe over there or something? Oh, I'm actually not far from the town now either. Interesting. Oh, look at that. So the fort of Tavar's right there. But that alb converter is right friggin' there. It's not... F oh my gosh. That's pretty friggin' close. No wonder they feel like they're under threat a lot. Okay. Well, let me see. Where is this? It's really close by, so this way a little bit. Can I see anything? I can't really tell. Um, okay, well, if I don't die doing this, let me see if I can get up above, maybe. I don't want to jump off, obviously. Okay. Go back this way. Okay. Um, still can't really see. Can't tell anything from here. So even if I could see what it was, like if I could see it from here, there's no way I'm going to be able to tell. There's some plants in the middle of this. Interesting. Golden Whisper. Interesting. I don't think I've seen them before. And it's accompanied by all these, like, wasps and stuff. Or fireflies, maybe? I'm not sure what those are. Okay, what, is, what does this say? Uh, herb, right? Golden Whisper. Very rare and valuable in alchemy. Regeneration, duration, fight. I'm obviously not going to use it for health. But, so it's a very rare alchemy thing. Okay. All right, um, I don't remember if I saved it. Uh, where, so what side? So it's like up here, basically, it looks like. So is it, it's just down there? I can't see. Oh, is that it? Is that the ball? I wonder if that ball is it. Interesting. Uh, but being infested by a bunch of insects, I really don't know. Ha <laughs> ha! Um, yeah. Well, that's great. So there. Where are the actual? So there's one right there. And there's one right there. Jeez. 
So even if I don't lose aggro, I can go like in that center or whatever and probably not get... get hit by anything. Um... This is problematic. Okay, let's see if I can go up onto that over there, maybe? And see if that draws aggro. If that draws aggro, then this is maybe not the best plan. But if that's okay... Oh, I should probably do one of these also, right? So I'm not down a whole bunch of... Okay, well now I'll probably draw aggro if I go right there. What if I go over to this one over there? Maybe that one will be okay? I don't... That's the thing is, I really don't know how close or far away I can be from these. Let's try that far one. This one seems like it's going to be way too close. That far one might be okay. Okay, let's... Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, crap. Oh. oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, there's a... Oh! This one's dead. And there are a couple... There are some dead people next to it, too. Crap. Um, I don't know if I can do it without, it, with it without drawing aggro, though. But if that one is far enough away... Traveling merchant? Oh, jeez. So he and his guards were... So they must have drawn aggro from another one. And... Because otherwise, how did the Ripper die if they are dead as well, right? So they must have... Jeez. I hope these traveling merchants, like, respawn and stuff. Because there's all this... Okay, I'm going to go for it. Nope. Ow. Mm. Gosh. Crap. No. Nope. Stop. Stop. Run. Oh, good night. I think I lost aggro. Okay. So I got it. Phew. <laughs> ah, kind of barely, but I got it. I can turn in the parts on this quest. Okay. So, yep. Uh, yeah. You should go to the camp in Idan. All right. So he's going to go back and sit down or... Whatever it was he does, I'll sleep since there's a sleeping bag right here. Yep. Sure. Sure, the morning, whatever. Sounds good. Okay, so now to, to the Duke's bunker. And that's almost right where I need to be to turn in anyway, right? Because I will be turning in the parts to Conrad... And then I guess talking to the Duke afterward? I think. So there's the Duke. So where's Conrad from here? It's like... Um, where is it? Okay, let's go let's past this. I'm sure it's outside of here. Oh, here we go. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I'll talk to you later, Nasty. I don't freaking... I don't trust you. You're like, hey, I have a job for you. And that's like, you have to kill these monsters. I'm like, wait, what? What? what, what, what why? Why Why now? I'm a wuss. <laughs> I'm so unprepared for that. Uh, Elmar? Not now. Yeah, he didn't have... 
really anything to say other than complaining that he was captive and he didn't care what faction I belonged to, if any. Obviously, I technically probably... Technically, I'm still Alp faction. I, mean, I basically left them, but I haven't joined another, so I don't know if you really retain your faction. Anyway. I'm not helping the Mad Mad build his bomb. Yeah, the problem with this is, of course, I've already agreed to it, so... Uh, okay. So here we go. Here's the inverse phase inductor. Good, good, good! That will fix the inconsistencies in the first cycle. That means we shouldn't evaporate ourselves when trying to use this. <laughs> Get the rest of the components, and the Big Bang will finally bang, and blast, and vaporize. You better hurry. The Duke is waiting. Here. The proprietary Edwards condenser. I'll get that fitted right away. We're one step closer. Just a few more pieces, and she'll be up and ready. Better hurry up! The cross armature coil. You found one! Ah! The desert isn't just sand. She has everything you need, if you just look for it. That's it. That, 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 that's all I need. This should finish the job. I hope. I'll need time to finish it. I hope. But then, she's gonna fly! You wait till you see her in action. This is going to be incredible. This will take me some time, but you can tell the Duke everything is running smoothly here. Just about. I think. You can lead me to it and be ready for the light show. Okay. Uh, if it's my vote, I say you strike Zaykor, or Zaykor's the land, I guess, the region. But whatever, you strike the Ice Palace or whatever, the Albs in Zaykor. That would be my vote, since the Albs are douches. And I can't, apparently, as far as I know, at least join their faction anyway. So let's just nuke the douches that nobody wants anyway. Nobody wants to become part of them. Uh, okay, so then I go like this. Hi, Team Jackal. Good boy. All right. That's this. Big Bang has been completed. You got the job done? We just got nuked? Or... Why do I feel like this was a mistake? First Alexiter Tarek, you summon me. Yes. We need to order a new troop deployment. You are to move forces out of Edan to the border of Ignadon. So the hybrid orders, so his will must be done. Ignadon. Did the hybrid explain why we are to move troops from an area where we are short of forces to face an enemy incapable of threatening us? It is not for the hybrid to explain himself. His will is the directive. The directive must be followed. I serve the hybrid, all elix to the hybrid. But with the converter and Edan silent, how are we to achieve that? It is not for us to question the hybrid. The Albs existed before the hybrid. We gathered Elix for ourselves without his guidance. Our first directive was to reach the next stage of evolution. How are we to achieve that if all our Elix goes to him? The hybrid sees our future. Through him, we will evolve. So, he says so. He always said. And yet he orders, he consumes, and we die. It is for the greater purpose. Have you ever asked yourself what will happen to us once we've harvested all the elix from the free people? Where will he turn then? The hybrid sees things that we do not. He saw the fall. The world ignored him, and all was fire. The Alps will not repeat that mistake. He sees our future, and his cause is ours. We must deliver his vision, efficiently, and no one can stand in its way no matter their rank. You will begin the redeployment immediately and without further question. Yes, First Alexator. All Elix to the hybrid.
If that's true, then where is Big Bang now? Is it already on its way to its target? No, it is still here. I said the job was to be finished. It isn't finished until Big Bang is launched. So go and make sure it is sent to its target. Move! Say, are you deaf? Get Conrad to finish the damn job. Either Big Bang gets to its target, or I'll feed you both to the jackals. Isn't there another way? Yeah. You can sit there, take some cams, and dream. Dream a pretty little dream. How have other people become outlaws? They've made their name. Big mouths we people out quickly. Many people like to say who they are and what they can do. The fort quickly finds out if they can. I want to get some of the armor you have here. Talk to my cousin William. He deals with that sort of thing. But if you join us, you will swear loyalty to me for good. You'll start as a runner, but prove loyal. And you can become an enforcer, or maybe even a captain. Each rank comes with its rewards. But all this is easy to talk of. Harder, much harder, for you to achieve. Alright. Well, I guess it didn't go move me on to another chapter, or tell me anything that sounds like it's irreversible. So hopefully I'm okay continuing. I guess we'll find out at some point. Okay, we had, I think let's try this one. It's back to Adan, but there's, well, I actually have this too. Hang on, let me, I'm a little bit into nine. Okay, let me increase my strength, I think. I was thinking that the outlaws were going to be nothing but a bunch of gunslingers, and it looks like they do have some of the, some guns, like pistols and stun rifles too. But it looks like they still mainly use like some variant of swords and stuff. So, okay, who was uh, Mad Bob? Or sorry, Scrap Baron, Mad Bob, Scrap Baron, whatever. Anyway, he is one who can teach me. Survival skills. Oh. Liquor. And a random sleeping bag, of course, because of stuff. Yeah, I heard something similar happened in South Tavar. Oh, and there's Rat also. Alright, let's talk to Rat. It's been a couple of days because I've slept a couple of times. Yes, the plan is forming. And? Chloe's finally opening up. It just took a little time to get through to her, and then some drink to get her talking. What information did you get out of her? Why she can't pay the Duke. I mean, she's in charge of the entertainment district, so she should have Alexit coming out of her ears, right? Yet, she's desperate to collect debt money. She's got no shards to spend. She can't cover the Duke's tribute. I mean, there has to be a story to be told. And? Are you going to tell me the story? Chloe is being forced to pay protection money. She can't pay the Duke or anyone else because she's already being bled dry. Hmm, we shouldn't talk here. Walk with me a moment. Let's go talk outside. Follow me and try not to get noticed. Okay, go ahead. I don't want everybody to hear what I'm about to tell you. Crap, the situation is this... isn't exactly safe for anyone. If that's the way you feel, is this like... ask around and see let's get somewhere time. we can talk. Is this like in Risen where he's going to friggin' attack me when we're not near anybody? God dang it. Frickin' I hated that in Risen. I was like, you're a douche. Okay, and now this I don't guy... think anyone will overhear us here. So, this is what I've learned. A guy called Blake is behind this. He's forcing Chloe to pay protection money. Hmm. Who is Blake? Blake is one of the district overseers here. He's in the upper section of the fort. Not the best overseer we have, let's put it that way. Total self-righteous asshole, to put it another. But who am I to question the Duke? Yeah, I already knew who... 
Blake was, but I wanted to get more information on him. Um, so, you finally got some information. How could you doubt the rat? Before we go any further, let me make one thing clear. Under no circumstances should you speak to Blake. If you approach him now, I've got no doubt he'd back off and leave Chloe alone. But that would just mean he'd just come back later when he thought things had blown over. We need to force him to forget about the protection money for good. Otherwise, what's the point? Uh, yeah, this will wreck the plan though, right? I don't, again, I'm not fully on the Dukes. I mean, I, I'm, I want, we've said, I've said this before, I'm pretty positive. I mean, I still have to go visit the clerics too, but I'm guessing I want to become an outlaw. If I, if I become an outlaw though, that doesn't necessarily mean I trust the Duke. Also doesn't mean I trust Rad or Blake or some of these other guys either, but let's not do this though, because this will continue the quest, I think. So, what's the plan? We should focus on Blake. Despite all his influence, he's been going through bodyguards. Three of them have died in the last two months, but if anybody knows why, nobody is sane. We need to go through his things and find out why. There has to be some dirt there and we could use it. We just need some hint. Then we can sort all this out to our benefit. Chloe gets freed from Blake and we get the shards we need. Why do you think the bodyguards are dead? Well, he seems to have some business to take care of outside the fort. And sure, it can be dangerous out there. And Blake claims the bodyguards were killed by jackals while he was out hunting. But that just doesn't sound right. If you can get to Blake's place, look through his things, then maybe you can turn up some proof of what really happened. Anything that relates to bodyguards. Yeah, why don't you go? <laughs> yeah, and then I deny myself experience, potentially. Okay. Uh, Rat, if you betray me again, I swear I am going to kill you. Like, I was close to picking a fight with you anyway, but I suck at fighting, so... But I swear, if you betray me again, when I'm strong enough, I will kill your ass. Okay. Okay. I'll look for the proof at Blake's house. Follow the rat's plan, and you'll come out ahead, my friend. Look through Blake's stuff and come back to me when you've found something. Then we'll figure out the next step. I am going back to Chloe's bar. I'll see you there. All right. So let's go back to what we were going to do. Oh, no. First, I want... Because I was headed there anyway. I want to talk to the Scrap Baron. About... That was weird. Anyway, uh, training in some survival skills. I had good eater I wanted to do. And stamina for sure. And then I don't know what else. But we'll see. Do you want to die? <laughs> Teach me something. It will be done. Okay, so one level of good eater. Yes. So now, I get more health when I eat food. Oh, extra hit points? Yeah, actually. There are resistances too, but I think, yeah. So let's do this. And this. I'm pretty sure I can't do... Yeah, I barely do the constitution for this, so I'm sure I can't do the second one. Yeah, 60. Okay. So now... I have survival four, so I can talk to Hank. Where is Hank, by the way? Over here, right? Yeah. And I can get something from him. Okay. What else do you give out apart from food? Nothing! Where did you get that information? I have no idea what you're talking about. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Smart one, aren't you? All right, all right. 
So, in addition to food, the scavengers also bring me various items they find out buried in the sand. You know, basic stuff such as weapons, ammunition, high-grade salvage, that kind of stuff. Why? Are you wanting to trade? I only deal with the right type of person, but I could bring myself to deal with you. So, what are you looking for? Show me the weapons you have. Here, uh, just don't pay attention to the rust spots. Spear gun? Oh, well that's a better ranged weapon anyway. All right, dude, you ready to go again? Cause we're gonna go. Follow me. Yeah. Okay, that's, there's a critter over there. Oh, a couple of critters, and then... Is that a troll? Hey. Not watching my stamina like I should be, apparently. Oops, well, whatever. Doesn't matter. Hey! Oh! <coughs> Duras, jerk! <coughs> what the hell? <coughs> oh, the attacks are a lot faster with this. Interesting. Interesting. So it's a much faster weapon. That's cool. Okay, I didn't really... Oh, what's that? Okay, I'm gonna have to go there at some point. Look at... Check out what that is, but... Let's not... Let's stay on course. <laughs> okay, Duder. Let's go to... Yep. Alright, man. Um, there was a journal in the hotel or something? Yeah, back. Oh, yeah. No, I know that. Yeah, that's the journal. Yep. So, hang on. I've already seen that before, so... Alright, hang on. So, this journal... Crawl's diary. No sign of the man. But let's see if he has left me a clue in here. Last entry. First the Elix devours him. Now it devours me. But I have no choice. Surely to steal is better than to kill. If I don't act now, then death must follow. So, the choice is made, and we must both go into the mausoleum. Perhaps we can live in this house of the dead. <laughs> Either this guy is reliving teenage poetry, or I just found out where he went. I should tell Caldrum. Alright, so let's... There was an angle. It's something, there was a... There we go. Climb. Cauldron is going to be down here. Over. All right, where is he inside now? Yeah, there we go. Well, I found Crawl's diary. Where did you find it? And does it tell you anything useful? By the balcony of Ragnar's stronghold. Kral wrote about a mausoleum outside of Goliath. Maybe he went there. Then he has picked the perfect place to hide. I don't know anyone who would go willing into that mausoleum to search for him. It is a place for the dead. I'll go. If you tell me where it is. Very well. 
you will find the mausoleum in the area outside Goliath that is down below the pit, south, southeast towards the world heart. Tread carefully, though. People are telling stories of some sort of undead creature there. Not that I believe in such things myself. Okay, so probably something too high for my level right now. Is this north? There's no compass, so... Yeah. Uh, okay, let's see what this is. I hadn't really planned on this for this part, but I guess... This could be dangerous. Time to teach you a lesson. Okay. He said this could be dangerous, so I was assuming this is bad news. <laughs> get him! Get him, Doris, get him! Alright. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Uh, there's a couple. What happens if I... Is there anybody up above? Oh! Duras! What the crapping? Okay, hang on. <laughs> he didn't like that I went the way I went, apparently. So he went through and drew a whole bunch of stuff. Um... Uh, let's not go up there then yet, because if he's going to do that, I don't want to friggin' pull everything in the fort. Come here. Okay. That's hopefully just one, or maybe two. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, and okay. Okay, that's a mistake. <laughs> uh, well, they had only one guard came before. Maybe I can. Oh, uh, well, if I don't, if I don't get killed by the troll, that is. The can go around the side. And okay. We're on the side here. Can I just get one? Come here. What? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's a problem. Hmm. <laughs> really? So I can't. Is there no other way? Maybe just get one. You are so dead. Now you're in trouble. Uh, this could be bad news. Oh, run. Run. Run, 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 run. How you doing, buddy? You okay? Oh, they're coming. Oh, they're coming, Duras. Is 
So most of them... Oh, there's a raptor also now? They're fantastic. Okay, hang on. <laughs> okay. Uh, apparently there are raptors nearby, so let's handle them first, I guess. Over there as well as... Okay. Let's do this. Two. I'll get this one. Why can I not hit? I don't know. Alright. Alright, not bad, not bad. And I'm doing a lot better in battle, both because my weapon does more and because I have higher strength. So that's actually good. Alright. Alright, Dieter. Enough now. Okay, this side doesn't seem to be working, so let me try. Uh, uh, hang on. What's you? Okay, this must be the other entrance. Uh, you, hmm. Stay here. Stay here. All right. Is there a single guard over here I can lure, maybe? Oh, that's the whole... Wait, what? They turn away? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. <coughs> what 
What a stupid glitch. Okay, that's an exploit. Let's not do that. That was fun for a little bit, but let's. Yeah. This could be challenging. You are dead. And it's the whole friggin' fort, obviously. I don't know where Duras went down. I guess I'll come over here so he has some space and maybe he'll wake up and then I can swing back by and get him. I don't know. Here we go. I'll help you. That way, they're raptors, looks like. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, Doe. Yeah, Duras is still stunned, looks like. Yeah, if I go over this way a little bit farther, I don't want to go too far because there's always a chance there's other stuff farther down that'll draw him as well, right? Hey, thanks buddy. fun. This is actually fun for me. <laughs> I try to dodge, not get killed, and finish some of them off. Alright, yep. I know. Alright, let's go a little bit this way, maybe. I don't go too far. Maybe this will let Duras wake up, though. Yep. Kind of figured I was going to get hit, that. but at least... Get over here. Come over here, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. <laughs> I should have locked on because I apparently stopped deselected him. So now suddenly I'm not attacking him, the same guy.
Someday Duras will wake up. <laughs> ah, there we go. I'll help you. I'm so almost dead. <laughs> Couple of those apparently. Wait, can I not get another? There we go. Guess there's a cooldown or something, I'm not sure. Alright, dude. Jeez. Okay, three left. Four, four left. Three left. Okay. Okay, all that running around, but we did it. Woohoo! Two, three, four, five. <laughs> we'll just tally them up. Six, seven. Is that it? We got this one, right? Yeah. At least eight of them running around over and over and over. Plus, I think there was one, there were one or two over here as well. I'm not positive on that count though. Something like eight though. I guess they thought because. I was on the ground that it'd be easier to get me on hand or something. We better be on our guard here. I don't know how many more there are in here, but okay. you have a Freddy? Nobody else came. Maybe they all came with the last group, pretty much, except for him. I don't know. Let's look and see if there are any guards around first before we loot. Uh, I don't see any guards. Okay. I don't see anything to loot on this level. There was for sure something over here my initial attempt. Okay, and then... Quiver. Nice. I have arrows. I have arrows. Actually, I already have bought some, but... But I have, like, more arrows. else back here. I don't see anything. Okay. And then through. Large bag of Alexit. 
50? Okay, that's not bad. Clever. Why is it forbidden? This whole area is forbidden technically, right? Because they're, they're, they're reavers. And they just, like, attack on sight. Doesn't that just automatically make everything forbidden? <laughs> Weird. Whatever. Um... Campfire, small mana potion. Uh, apparently, I can't go in there any farther. All right. Uh, something up on top there? Maybe. Yeah, let's finish down here, I guess. Raw meat. Iron fists shield? Okay. Nice. I'll have to check that out here in a second. Recipe to make lifeline. Okay, lifeline. I think I have. One lifeline injection already, right? It's a chem, if I remember right. Oh, didn't go over here. We'll exit. Cigarette. Pack. Another cigarette. Okay. Okay, and then I was already over there before. Excuse me, Dora. Sorry, man. <coughs> okay, I'll try to remember to read the description of Iron Fist po or Shield and everything next time, but that's going to be it for this part. So thanks, everybody, for watching. This has been number... Um, 17, I believe, of my playthrough of Elix. I am Zexor. Smash thumbs up if you like this video. It helps a lot. If you haven't already done so, don't forget to subscribe. For more content like this, follow me on social media to get notified when I post a new video, get reminded about my live streams each weekend, to get let known when I'm able to afford to do a giveaway, and so on. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Till then, peace.